I think obviously being from the borders is, it's like rugby mad. So growing up, it was always, everyone was rugby mad, all my pals and that played it. So um, growing up, I never really had any notions of being, oh, I'm gonna be a pro for any other team. So <coughs> I only ever really wanted to aspire to play for Jed first, which, uh, you know, like we could back it now, like I loved my time there and it was, it was, it was great fun and, you know, like, I loved even like, even when I was growing up there, just being a ball boy for the first and that, like looked up some of the boys so much. So yeah, it was, uh, it means a lot to me. I remember when my mum first took me, um, I think I was about seven when I first started, just at Jed Mini. So um, yeah, I was a winger. Um, I was quite quick, scored a lot of tries. Um, and then obviously when I got o older, maybe slowed down a bit and got a lot taller. So they put me in the middle row. Um, but um, but yeah, I loved it. And a lot of my pals that I played with at Jed Minis then when I was seven, I'm still really good pals with now. Uh, some of my best pals. So um, we've we've known each other for years now, and they, they're not playing rugby as much now, but they like uh, like supporting me. But uh, it's good to be back in the mix, and you know, like coming off the bus and that at Murrayfield, like I say that every time I've done that, and especially the times that I've played here, it's one of the best feelings. Is I don't know if they do that at any other ground, a lot of grounds. We were actually saying the other day, a lot of the grounds, you come in under the ground, don't see any of the fans, and you're just straight into the changing rooms. But I think that's what's quite unique about Murrayfield is when you come off the bus and you get piped in, and there's literally fans everywhere, and it's uh, uh, it's, it's unbelievable. We used to always come up with Jed Minis and that, and it was always a right good day out. Like you'd come up for McDonald's and stuff. <laughs> and, uh, like come in, it was always freezing. I remember Murrayfield always being freezing, but um, but now you loved it and I remember just watching it and you know everyone everyone down there obviously is rugby mad so watching Scotland play was like watching the pinnacle of rugby so it was always quite quite awe quite awe inspiring when you came up. I think for me it's just a confidence thing and just just getting minutes under the belt is I'm one of those players I think that if I play it the more I play the more confident I feel. Um, and just pick up in bits that you'd maybe be a bit rusty on if you hadn't played much. So it's just probably just a accumulation of game time and just the more that you play, the more confident you feel and then the more likely you are to go out and express yourself. Yeah, totally. We love it here. We absolutely love it. And um, you know, my wife loves it. We've got nothing but really happy memories since since moving here. Um, you know, it was just the three of us when I moved up, but my daughter was born here. Um, so it's four of us now. and. Yeah, we love it. We've got family really close by and we, we see so much of them. So um, yeah, I'm very happy.